Give it a rest, Gil. The exam's tomorrow. So's Josh. Does it sort these boxes out? And I'll make up to your dad. You alright? All I ever do around here is cause problems. That's not true. Yeah, do you want to give us a hand with this? Do a smoke. Yeah? Yeah, why not, yeah? Where's Calvin? Um, he's got this crying thing to sort out. What a surprise. I'm just here for calm. Well, this is cosy. Right. To Louise's freedom. Cheers, everybody. Thank Cheers. you for coming. It's been a horrible few weeks and uh, I'm just glad it's all over. No way. You bitch! How could you come here? You nasty, vile... My little boy is locked up because of you and you come here to drink! Thank you, let's go upstairs. Uh, Louise didn't mean to cause any trouble. Your little boy murdered my husband. And you expect sympathy? No one believes that. You set him up. I don't know how you did it, but you set him up. He tried to kill his own child. How can you defend him? He's a psychopath. He's not. He's not. They set him up. Carmel. Where were we? You know, maybe you are innocent, Warren. No. Maybe you are, Louise. Maybe Jake's guilty and Frankie and Jack know about it all along. I, maybe not. I, I don't know. You know I, I don't know what's going on. What I do know is this... This is wrong. You coming? Please don't go. Muto and Rollin Sando. How do you remember that? The more ridiculous the word, the more it sticks. What's all this then? Well, I'm just getting a little bit creative, Neff. First of all, we got a fish finger of pie, a fish finger of bar, and then to top it off, two fish fingers get in. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's a great comfort having you around, Gilly. You're a great help. Dev, I've practically made you bankrupt with fish fingers. No, we all make mistakes. Thing is, you fix them. Or at least you try to. It's good. It takes the pressure off. Just helping out on that. Yeah, and you help Josh out as well. <laughs> well, you know, music theory's always come easy to me. Yeah, right. How'd you like to be manager of the shop? Yeah, sure enough. No, you deserve it. Can you see this? I'm gonna be the manager of the show! Go in, Ed. You see, what people fail to realise, what they refuse to consider, is what it's actually like to be accused of murdering your own husband. Yeah, it couldn't have been nice. You don't even have time to grieve, and everybody looks at you like you're filth. Yeah, well, it's over now. And she expects sympathy. We should just go on, you know, move on. It makes me laugh. Shut up. I can't sit here no longer and listen to this hatred and bitterness. She just accused me of setting her son up. Even if Jake did kill Sean, which to be honest, no one round here believes you, no matter how much you say it. He admitted it to the police. Even if he did, that is her son been put away for murder. How do you think she feels as a mother? Just have some... Humanity? Yeah. Humanity. Sleeve. That's what I do. Yeah, I know. I'm the one who washes it for you. Sorry. I believe they just rubbed our noses in it like that. Let's not forget who brought them into our lives in the first place. What he meant when he said, it's not like we didn't get anything out of it. Any ideas, Darren? Me? 
How can I possibly know that? Enough! You know, my boy's in a mental hospital and all you two do is snap at each other. Newt's only 15 years old and frankly he's far more help around here than you two. Imagine letting Louise and Warren swan around down there in my pub. You two are so weak, they just let your enemies walk all over you. Come on, pull yourselves together. You know, be men, be a family. No more fighting lights. Enough's enough! You're not going to tell her, are you? About the Cumberland. I know you're going to be angry, I swear. If you hit me, they're all through there in the lair, right? I'm not going to hit you, Josh. Right, we're not doing anything to Niall. Frank is through there in tears because of everything that's happened. And every time you and me do something, it hurts him more and more. And I'm never doing anything ever again. Okay. You don't have to say. Yeah? Of course. If you know you felt this strongly about it, I never would have brought it up. I just thought that you liked this Lauren girl. I want Frankie to be happy. I can't do anything to hurt her. A good kid, Newt. I thought you were going to be angry. I was going to do a nice little redecorating job on that salon. It's just a waste of red paint. But I'm not angry. Not coming to bed. <laughs>